hello everyone welcome to this video in this video i'm going to talk about that how can you solve the error that uh, you might be getting when you're trying to copy a file that means you are not able to copy the file and you're getting an error that we are not able to copy the file there is some issue with the source file or the source file is corrupted if you're getting this issue then what you need to do first step is you need to make sure that your pc is uh, free from virus attacks so for that what we are going to do is we are going to the settings app and we are going to take a quick scan of our pc so once in the settings app go to updates and security and go to windows security go to open windows security so that should open up your windows security make sure your virus and threat protection is all checked in green like in my case then again go to virus and threat protection and click on quick scan so this would uh, just carry out a quick scan for your pc and uh, rule out any of the virus information uh, or any of the threats information once that is done and if still your issue is not solved still there is an error uh, that the source file is corrupted then what you can do is you can go to this pc and check that your uh, disk is all right it is not corrupted the disk is not corrupted so for this just right click go to properties go to tools and here in the error checking click on check so uh, here you will get an option to scan the drive so once you click on that it would take three to four minutes to scan the drive as a whole and if there are any issues it will show you the issues and then you can fix it using a troubleshooter still if your issue is not solved after this then what you need to do is update the drivers so for this you need to go to the search bar and type in device manager once you have uh, got to the device manager then you can just select your uh, desktop name and right click and click on scan for hardware changes so it would scan for any of the hardware changes in the drivers that have been recently performed and will update all your drivers so that should solve your issue that's it for this video thanks for watching